So I saw this really cool video idea by RT Game that reminded me of an old server I used to have where everyone had their own creative build chunks. And I thought today I would also take a hundred players and have a $100 Amazon gift card reward to the person who made the coolest build inside of two hours on this world. Now, will everything go according to plan or will the trolls succeed at crashing the server by spawning too many marshmallows? Find out now and give the video a like. Let's hit a thousand likes as the goal here today. And according to YouTube statistics, the majority of you watching this video here today are not yet subscribed to my channel, so please consider subscribing with the notification bell enabled so you never miss a thing. It's free and you can always change your mind later. Every player on here has one chunk. It's going to be interesting and I'm sure I'll see a couple of dongers on here. Hopefully people keep it mostly appropriate and we have a good time today and see what kind of creative builds pop up on the server. We have a ghast. Why? Why is there already marshmallows in here? What's the point, guys? It's not a build. Oh, he's doing it again. What is his skin? Literally, the Marshmallow Master. Oh no, he's a totem pole, Steve. And now the entire build server sounds like the nether. Screaming schmores roaming the world. Fantastic. Well, like I said, there's absolutely no rules to this. So it's going to be really interesting to see how this world develops in each of these chunks because people can make creative things like looks like we got some pixel art starting here. They can just spawn infinite mobs apparently and make our skies filled with marshmallow gas. Some people are doing a little bit of gardening. That's a pretty cool setup. Oh boy, they're writing to me. Hi. Uh, hello, sir. Hope you have a fantastic build today. We have a chicken in progress. Looks like someone's making a very awkward pixel art of me. Oh God, my legs, what happened? That is a nice thigh gap though. Oh, we have a whole jungle biome in progress, nice. The nether has arrived here as well. This man's trying to make some potions. Let's have a brew fest, nice. It's gonna be interesting to see the contrast of builds because right here we have what looks to be the makings of some kind of modern mansion. And then right next to it, you have the pyramid of Giza. Oh, this is cute. Do we have a little monkey? Monkey S right here. Man working on Betty right now. Big respect points for chicken. Say it with me in the comment section for nostalgia's sake. In Benji we trust, for Baka we must, and for Betty we lust. The cringe. Speaking of which, Benja trust, bow we must. Man's just making a god set here. What kind of bow are we- I broke his bow. Uh, <laughs> uh, now I have a funky stick at Lake? 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 Yes, sir. Uh, we have a problem? Did you give me this eater speed stick? The what? <laughs> Do people have access to command blocks somehow? Someone just gave me a plus 1000% speed stick. I'm very confused, but this is awesome. Big Monka S. Oh God, the Bajan Canadian build is just looking more and more awkward by the second. No offense, Blue Six. I think I can say that. It's like a Picasso. You know, you're working on something nice here, trying to impress me. Bit of a suck up. But I'm not, uh, I'm not sure how the scale of this is really working out for you. My legs, sick thigh gap, but I'm not sure what's going on with them. What are you trying to say? This does not look the same at all. Not even close so far. But maybe I'll be in for a pleasant surprise. Oh snap, the pyramid is turning into an hourglass. This is cool. And someone realized they can get bedrock. Well, I guess it is technically part of the nether to have a bedrock ceiling. Uh, Lake, you never answered my question though. What's the speed one billion stick? Dude, I don't even know. I don't think command blocks are enabled though. I don't know how this guy gave me this thing. <laughs> oh God, I'm in the void! Follow me, Blue. Trying to edumacate you. This is slightly more accurate. Although I'm built like an Enderman, very long and lanky, it actually seems kind of cool to me. I kind of like the popsicle stick vibe. This on the other hand, you got me looking so strange with these legs, I can't get over it. What are those? Like my booty does not look like that. This is a pretty cool build here too with the like ritual statue out front and the mossy cobblestone reminds me of like a Mayan temple in progress. I wonder if this man's trying to make Chichen Itza out here. This really does look like a baby Yoda meme, but we got some pokeballs coming in hot. Oh my gosh, I know I keep coming back to this build, but what is going on, Blue? Come on, man. What are you doing to me here? Making me look more derpy by the second. No offense, I wouldn't do any better myself, but <laughs> this is scary, man. This is a scary angle. Letting everyone know on the server that I'm gone for 30 minutes and then I'll be back to do a progress update. So enjoy the time lapse. This should look pretty sick.
though. Seriously? I come back to this? Oh, brother. KSI, knowledge, truth, integrity. Sick build right here. Oh god, it's like a hero brine version of me. This is a cursed image if I've ever seen one. Look at how many gas are up there in the sky right now. Oh my lord. They may have said I'ma head out, but they are gathering and preparing to block out the sun. Look at the cloud of gas. Why? Why is this a thing? We're trying to build in peace down here. Are the trolls really gonna win? Whoever is spawning these gas is actually catching the victory royale right now. This is so laggy. I have to sign in on an alt admin account and hopefully kill all the gas off. All right, help has arrived. I really hope this works. Kill all the gas. Please spare us. We've done it. We've cleansed the server. No more gas lag here. Oh no, the amount of items that just rained down from the sky. Oh no. Cleared the entities, we good. Now, back to exploring the builds as of this current moment on the server. Looks like Winged Barb has made himself a boss tower. Looking sick up here, nice build, dude. This feels like it should actually be part of the new nether. And then right next to it, you've got Rainbow Beacon Nether. Oh snap, they tried to spawn in a wither. Thank goodness this was disabled. Or you already know there would have been thousands and thousands of withers flying around here. These people are brutal. They put a Lake B sign on this build and then lit it all on fire. Lake, I'm sorry, man. There's some real hate out here. Is this a teapot on fire? Are they really spilling this much tea? Oh, let's check out the update on this end structure. The Skybounds Museum, free to the public. Um, what are you trying to say, huh? Skybounds ain't dead. Wow, this build I'm in right now is actually super pleasant to be a part of. It feels like the start of a spawn hub for players on a server to explore and see what's going on. Really, really clean build. Now, over here at the Hero Brian Bajan Canadian headquarters, I didn't realize this. They put a BBB, which is an homage to my very first survival series on Minecraft called My Big Booty Bi What is this? This reminds me of the Smurfs right here for some reason. Pretty cool though. They've got what appears to be some sort of sailboat underneath inside the cave. And then up above, they've got a villager, Papa Smurf, living his life out here. This is a real cute build. I like it. Obviously, Chess Malone. But what is going on in here? This, what is he doing? Is he trying to invade his neighbor? Oh God, he is. You've been busted, brother. I see what's happening here. He's trying to invade his neighbor and he's doing it successfully. What a troll. <laughs> He's actually putting blocks into his neighbor's area. Oh no. I think he's trying to blow it up with an end crystal. Not like this. When the troll gets trolled back, eat it. Dang, this is the Mayan Chichen Itza build that has become a throne. An absolute legendary throne right here. You have a Prismarine wishing well and a Wither Rose throne. Yo, someone made a parkour course. I'm gonna have to try this. That's sick. I'll let them finish building it, then I'll give it a try later. I gotta take a look at this structure. We've got a big incorporation happening here. Let's see what's inside this LLC. Oh, it's run and owned by chickens. Great. These devilish corporate demons. They don't even give out health insurance benefits, these savages. This is pretty cool. It's like the tree of life right here. I dig it. This must be protected at all costs. It's like the avatar tree. Yo, the jungle biome is turning into a giant section of tree houses. That's epic. Someone here just made a cobble mining cube. Oh, it's a full on mine shaft. Dang. Oh no, poor guy. Sorry, Mitch. Got tired and need to go to bed. Good luck. They were working on something pretty cool here too. Well, hope you get some good sleep, my G. Thank you for the build. Someone built a perfect Minecraft ravine. This looks 100% natural here. I'd actually not realized this was player built. This is a sick home. If you're trying to make a natural looking home, this is the aesthetic you wanna go for right here. Now, obviously I have a lot more to discover and explore and I will be doing that in one hour once these builders have had more time to improve their work. Unfortunately, the trolls finally won out. It was supposed to be another hour of building, but in the midst of all that, they spawned in so many gas, the server crashed, and then we rebooted it and deleted all the gas, and now we're here. Players can't rejoin, so whatever progress they made is the final result of this build challenge video. So let's take a quick tour at the final builds and see what we see. Hey, it's me going to the high school prom, crying, not knowing what to do with my hands when we're on the dance floor. Awkward. My man's right here is a massive suck up. Built a Hunger Games cornucopia. I rate that, I rate that highly, and then 
above that, we have a lovely Skyblock classic. What a cute little puppy, yes. A cat, a bat, a spider, and a scorpion made a baby. Okay, let's try and identify the features. I think it's a bat head with a cat face, spider legs, and a scorpion tail. I nailed that. That's actually clean. That's really clean. Let's add this mob to Minecraft ASAP. Next door to the spider bat cat, we have a nice contemporary structure with a swimming pool with an awning for shade looking clean and sharp. Villagers in here watching premium television. Oh, snap. And their secrets? Let's check out the secrets. I'm into that. Yo, Big Tilt, what are you doing down here, brother? <laughs> we got enchants. We got a nether portal. And in truth, Big Tilt was trying to access a chest that was right here with a secret book, but unfortunately I couldn't open it and then deleting the chest caused the book to disappear. So I'm sorry, whoever built this, I can't read your secrets. But I can say I appreciate your tanning bed. We've got a classic Koopa Trooper. That's actually so sick. That is a handsome man right there. Shoutouts to Wizard Tower. Bajan is sexy. I have an aquarium with fish. Look at their name. Um, bad news, bud. All your fish are dead. You forgot to feed them. Wow, this is what we call Omega selling out. First build, implying they did more than one and did not like it, so they lit it on fire. Poor house. King and Commander Chicken. And on top of the chicken, there's a color-changing beacon light. That's actually pretty sick. I'm surprised this is the only one on the map because there's so many beacons, but only one that changes colors. So Bug Eye, Bajan Canadian, has now been encased in glass, given antlers, and he's got a big old says go down mitch i will pay it a visit oh my goodness the lingerie the vile creatures betty and team crafted <laughs> what a throwback freddy sylvia and betty the whole axe family and some spooky boobs what an homage now i can't make this the winner but i appreciate the nostalgia right there and the spooky boobs floating around oh no i just noticed what this is Oh no. Bajin, you've been waiting your whole life for this. She's the love of your life. We've been waiting for a while now. We support when you ask her. We love you, Mitch. Now take that YouTube money and go get your girl. Huh? Here's a ring for you, by the way. Oh God, Charlie, I'm, I'm kind of tripping out. Am I proposing to myself? Am I the beautiful flower bride over here? What is going on? Oh no. I've got a Bajin Canadian Gucci gang onesie with a chastity belt. This is just weird. Monkey, monkey, monkey. I love this build. This is one of my favorites. I like me a good monkey. Oh, snap. This can't possibly be the winner of today's video. A $100 giveaway. This man's got AirPods. They're already rich. This is a pretty sick build here. It's a fish tank. It's a full-on fish tank aquarium. That is really cool. I dig it. That's something different that no one else has done. And then up here would be like if you had a turtle or a frog or something, I guess they would live in this zone of the fish tank. That's so sick. Oh god, what are these? What's up with the beaks? Oh no, it's KSI and Logan Paul. We're in a boxing ring and they're about to brawl. Oh my gosh. Well, I think everyone's had enough of that. So let's move on. Let's take a look at the jungle area because they finally finished it all up. They have an enchanting zone with cats down lower. They have a village area with people making out and cats. Then lower, they've got dogs and a music disc and I'm surprised no cats. Then if I go all the way up, this is the village meeting room and cats. This person has an obsession with cats. I'm sorry. Oh snap, I almost forgot about the parkour course. I gotta do this. Nice, let's get it done. Starting down here, I guess. They said, please be fair and do it without fly. Start of jump and run. You got it. I'm gonna do a little jump and run right here. Grab that ladder. Easy game. Let's beat this parkour. Let's solo, YOLO, flawless. Not a single fly will be used this day. Not even once. Literally not even once. Off the wall. What's good? Invis jumps. Not a problem. Four block jump. Oh, so easy. Into the ladder stalls. Real talk though, this is pretty cool that they made a complete parkour map in a build competition. I did not anticipate seeing this happen. And what's sick is not only did they make a parkour, they managed to do it cooperatively with someone in the chunk next door. They had to work together to accomplish this. Otherwise, you wouldn't have been able to go that way. So I'm really impressed that this was possible. Checkpoint two, don't mind if I do. I just want to get to the next zone really badly. We'll start back at the checkpoint. I won't be a complete filthy cheater, just a little bit. Then we got to do a little ladder jump. NBD, NBD. Hop this way. And he says, jump to the other plot to the slimes. All right, I got you. I'm feeling it, Mr. Krabs. So cool. I'm absolutely loving this course. Really solid job to the builders here. 
What do I do now? Oh, there's a little invis block here. No problem. I got you. I'm picking up what you're putting down. And I've got a fresh set of ladder stalls. Let's scoop them up. Clearing through this. Easy breezy. The map maker's got an obsession with ladder jumps. I'm just glad I'm good at them. Except, what is this? This is a head bumper ladder jump. Is this even possible? I don't think... I don't know if I can do that. Admittedly, I tried it about 100 times. I'm not dealing with this head bumper. The new sign says, jump to the other plot to the slimes. I will jump this. The sickest jump you've ever seen. 360 jump Let's go. Okay, a little carpet fence post. Sure, no problem. I got you. Ooh, onto the trap doors. No problem. And I can't interact with these, so I think we lost. There's no way I can make this jump. It's literally impossible. So let's just fly to the next section of the course. It says very hard checkpoint three. And I think this is the end of the parkour, unfortunately. I'm pretty sure this is where the gas crashed the server and our beautiful parkour build came to a conclusion, sad times. Honestly though, big shout out to the people who work together to make this parkour course. I think that's really cool and I'm inspired by it. Thank you. Yo, check this build. We've got a bunch of the great wonders of the world. Number one, the Great Wall of China. I feel it. Keep the Mongolians out of here. We safe now with this wall. What's the second wonder gonna be? What do we have here? The Taj Mahal? This one I've gotta say is very clean. I like that a lot. The third one, the Petra. Oh, this is clean as well. They've nailed this. The detail, exquisite. What's our fourth one gonna be? It's the Colosseum. I like it. The Colosseum of Rome, not too bad. It's in ruins. It's shattered a bit, but I dig it. I like it. Realism. And they stopped. Feels bad. This could have been a real winner. This could have been a real winner. This could have been $100 on Amazon if you finished all your world wonders. Dang it. Ah, oh, really nice builds though. Now with mostly everything explored, I apologize if I missed your build. Please don't hate me. I love you long time and appreciate you joining in and participating nonetheless. It's time for me to choose a winner. This isn't easy. There's a lot of really great cool builds here, like I said. So for me to choose a winner to win $100, I want everyone to please be kind and courteous in the comment section. No salt, this was all in good fun. And at least someone today is walking out with a hundred bucks. So I wanna say thank you again. If you haven't done so, give the video a like right now. Let's get over 1,000 likes for this build challenge. If you guys wanna see more, just like it. You can let me know down in the comment section and I'll do my best to put more of these together with more great prizes. And of course, if you're new to my channel, before revealing the winner, I've got to ask that you subscribe with the notification bell on. It's free, so why not give it a try? I would much appreciate having you here for every video. And now, drum roll please. Oh god, this isn't the winner, but someone shanked me in the head. The winner is... Baby Yoda! Just kidding, don't freak out, it's not this. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. The winner is the nether tower. I'm giving it to wing bar because this looks like it could legitimately be a part of the nether expansion update. And I'd love to see new structures like this in the new nether in 116. That would be super, super sick. So big congrats to wing barb. Thank you all for participating in the build competition. Of course, there were so many other honorable mentions out here. I even realized I forgot to showcase this cabin on the hill. Really clean build with a nice ravine, glass water stream coming through it. Super clean. Lots of great structures, lots of great builds. Thanks again for everyone who participated and big shout outs to Wing Barb for winning the $100 Amazon gift card. Enjoy your shopping spree and I will see you all soon. And like I said before, if you haven't done so, please subscribe with the notification bell on. I hope to see a lot of new faces here on the channel. That's it for this video though. I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.